Hey guys, good morning. It is about 9.15. I know I heard you, yep. <laughs> oh, someone's here. Where are you running from? Look, uh, where are you running from? <laughs> Let their water. Let me go see who's at the door. Okay, it was just a package, but today, yesterday I was thinking, oh, I have so many plans for tomorrow. I actually have like the day. It's just Autumn and I, me and Autumn. Autumn and me, however that was supposed to be said. Pretty sure it was me and Autumn. Anyway, <laughs> I was thinking, oh, we're gonna do so much, and we're gonna run errands, and then I woke up this morning and I was like, oh, it's a nice day to just stay in and watch TV. <laughs> I have so many shows to catch up on, which I'm not that, that worried because any show that I really want to watch, I try and watch it when it comes out. Like Grey's, I try and stay caught up with it. Anything else that records, I'm you okay. I'm totally fine watching later. So that's not a really a big deal. But I'm gonna watch, oh careful, I'm gonna watch one show, go do Etsy orders, catch up on emails, edit, wait last Monday, almost got a wait last Wednesday. Yay, and I lost a little bit more weight. I wish it had been more for how hard I feel like I tried to stay on track this week, but this weekend was a little challenging. And what's funny, if you watch my weight loss Monday, um, which if not, I will link it down below, but it act, the way that it worked out was kind of weird because I actually, eating out the, for the weekend, but picking the right things, I lost more weight than I did the first part of the week, so I don't know. Anyway. I'm going to watch one show and then get busy. So Andres put the uh, baby present back up. Mm -hmm. And he just put it in a square with some toys, kind of to keep her wrangled. And look at this child. Uh-huh. She has figured out how to get up on it and down off of it. I know. Mm-hmm. You're so proud of yourself, huh? Uh, oh my goodness. <laughs> you're lucky you're cute. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't even know what to do. I'm all for her walking around and stuff, but she doesn't, like if I'm here, she doesn't walk around. She hangs out in this corner and you can see the saliva on the on the couch she just throws herself in the corner she doesn't walk around so then she was messing with the gate like the this she was shaking it and I was like do you want to get in and she put her hands up well now I realize why she wanted to get in she wants to put herself up on that thing that's dangerous mama I bet you if I took it out she'd have a fit let's see let me see Appa. come on get up well you don't have to get out you just got to get up let me have this Give to mommy. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Thank you. I knew it. She wants to play on that. You just want to play in this. But you can't stand on it, okay? Would you like it back, Autumn? Would you like it back? You want it back? Say please, mommy. What do you say? You're welcome. <laughs> Look, she wants it turned over. Look at this child. Oh my god. What am I going to do with you? What am I going to do? Oh, Lord, not. It's what? Are you going to pull it to the no. side? You're so strong. <laughs> Is that fun? You want it over here so you can stand on it? Mommy's afraid you're going to hurt yourself. Oh my goodness. Got her own little personality, man. Not even 17 months old. What the heezy? Hmm? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> this is what she was doing yesterday. Just sitting in it. Yay! Autumn! <laughs> Autumn's awake. Watch how she reacts to me. And then to Andres. Watch. 
Good morning. Good. What is that? What are you eating? What is that? Thank you. Good morning. Nope. Mommies. Thank you. Sad. <laughs> I am with you every day, Mama. <laughs> Mommy didn't get a clap. I didn't get a clap. Good morning. You sleep good? Yeah. Are you hungry? What? Are you hungry? <laughs> Ooh. Oh, yeah, that's a bunny. Say bunny. Adam, can you say bunny? You say bunny? No, okay. We tried. Next time, huh? Oh, yeah, I just filmed my weight loss Monday vlog. Now I'm about to upload it. And edited. I've been working on Etsy. I got to catch up on a show. I edited the vlog for tonight, which is awesome because all this week I work 5 to 10. 5 to 10. And it's a 30 minute drive home. So by the time I get home, I am not going to want to sit in front of this computer and edit the rest of the night, you know? So anyway, if you didn't check out my Weight Loss Monday video, go check it out. I'm asking for opinions kind of like a poll or advice or something i've been really considering switching it up for the month of february to see how that compares to what i did in january and although there's probably not going to be any comparison because i've lost so much weight in one month i feel like probably february even if i continue doing what i'm doing i wouldn't lose nearly as much anyway but i feel like i need a little bit of a switch up I feel like I'm clogging my arteries one day at a time, <laughs> so I don't know. Anyway, go check that video out. Like I said earlier, I have it linked down below. So these are the shirts. I have, actually, I got them. Well, you guys saw it like last week or the, yeah, like last week sometime. But I just had Emmy try it on, and I was really, when I first saw it, I was like, oh my God, it's not gonna fit. But if it's great, that's a medium. Put your arms down. It says, have courage and be kind. And if you're in Girl Scouts, you know that's the Girl Scout logo, and then our troop is 347. So it's a little bit bigger, so once I grow up a little bit more and I swim in Girl Scouts, it'll fit me perfectly. Yeah, that's super cool. I love it. Oh my gosh, it came out great. I hope the rest of the troop likes them. Mm -hmm. You have Girl Scouts tonight, you know that, right? Tonight? No, you, I guess you didn't know that. Tonight, at 6. So you gotta get on. Get on it. Homework, man. <laughs> Mommy didn't forget this week. <laughs> well, we forgot last week. I know. But it's okay. We have, we always have more Girl Scouts, you know? Right? Yeah. <laughs> and if you are in Girl Scouts, just be happy that you're in Girl Scouts because Girl Scouts is the best. I've been meaning to show you guys these boots for since I wore them last week. Last week or the week before? Whatever. Yeah, the week before. I don't know. Anyway, um, I don't remember where these are from. I've had them for so, so long. The brand is Lollipops. Not even focusing. Lollipops? Um, oh no. Jelly Pop. <laughs> Hello. Jelly Pop. Anyway, like I said, I don't know where I got them from. I don't even know what size they're in. But I really hadn't worn them in a long time. Because typically, I don't wear heels day to day. I mean, just because I'm not dressing up. And when I go to the hospital, I wear tennis shoes or typically I'll wear like lounge clothes that doesn't call, that doesn't call for high heels. So I really hadn't worn them. I don't even know that I wore them last tax season. So I wore them the day that I went to the hospital and I didn't notice the leather started cracking on them. Now they're fake. I'm sure they were like maybe 30 or $40, but the leather started cracking on them. And I had assumed it was because it was dry and I hadn't worn them in a while, but then look back here too. <laughs> now, luckily for these boots, when I put them on, 
they kind of slouch right here so it's almost like they go down like this so you can't see it as bad but like look at that that looks awful and then this one is even worse it has a, a cuff a scuff right there tearing right here and right here that you can clearly see uh, tear right there and then look at the back on this one it's like the whole thing is exposed and if, if this gets caught on anything it'll expose it even more so that stinks it kind of makes me feel like I should just pack them in but they're actually very comfortable boots and they're super cute but that stinks. So then these, I want to say I got these from JCPenney. I have a black pair, a brown pair, and this gray pair. It doesn't even have the brand or anything. But I want to say they were from JCPenney. A long, I've had them forever, so I doubt you could even get them. Probably something similar. But anyway, it's the exact same boot, just in black, brown, and gray. And the gray are my least worn. My most worn are, of course, black. So then I wore, the brown ones are downstairs. The black ones don't have any wear and tear here because I wear them frequently. So they don't get dusty or dry or anything. The brown ones I wore yesterday. Yeah, yesterday. And I uh, I can wear, I mean, they're not that big of a heel anyway, but I could wear them all, I wore them all day, nine hour day, up and down, walking around, and they were perfectly fine. I'll have to show them to you when I get an opportunity. But here, so like where the bend of the toe or the foot is when you're walking is all cracked and this part of the side on one of it is cracking kind of like that so I'm like what the heck I, I was asked somebody at work they're not real leather so I didn't really think that you had to like oil them up or anything and she was like I don't know maybe they need some oil so I'm wearing the gray ones and like I said the gray ones are my least worn so we'll kind of see tonight when I bend if it happens what I did was <laughs> you guys are probably going to laugh at me the only type of oil I had I used to have baby oil and I got rid of it I don't I don't know why I just wasn't using it for anything the only reason I bought baby oil in the first place was to uh, we have a home waxing kit and it was to get off the wax after we would wax but I thread and I've threaded for years so I don't even know why I had baby oil but I had bio oil from being pregnant and so I was like I wonder if this would work so I lathered it in my hands and I kind of just went over the leather all over the boots you can kind of tell it's a little shiny you can really see it on the heel um, so I'm gonna wear these today and see if it happens I don't know what else to do like I don't think these are salvageable at all I mean I probably could oil if this works I could oil them up so they don't go any worse but look at that's like awful <laughs> how would you would you guys just toss these boots like are they just done or would you do something I really like them they're cute they're super cute great for the rodeo too it's like the plus size girls type of um I don't know cowgirl boot um, just a little bit higher and these I really like as well and hopefully I mean luckily the black ones are my favorite and those are perfectly fine but I'm hoping once I wear these today they don't have the same problem so anyway suggestions down below or maybe like I said they're just ready for the trash let me know what you guys think okay I'm about to take off for work so far so good on the boots I've been walking around with them and we'll kind of see I have have on the gray ones with some black leggings and then this shirt is from Lane Bryant you guys have seen this before I've worn it it's the kind the one that has pearls and actually it's missing a few I probably should cut those off um, pearls and some little stones so I'm just wearing my diamonds by the yard um, by Elsa Peretti little diamond from Tiffany and Co. I don't know. Andres got me this for birthday or something one year. I'm wearing my hair in a. Um, yeah, that's fine. Emmy made really all A's and all E's in all her subjects. So it's just getting a little treat. Um, I have my hair in a Dutch braid that I typically like to alternate so that I don't have to put more product in it. Wedding ring, nothing on this arm at all. And then this one, I have this pearl bracelet. I think this is from Premier Jewelry as well, a while back. Oh, and then for dinner, I'm bringing some chunky guac from, I'll put it back in a, a minute, baby, um, from Costco. We have the pulled pork. I got four ounces of the pulled pork and then some cauliflower and cheese. That's what's for dinner tonight. So I'm about to head out. I will see you guys when I get home. So hi guys, I just got off from, from school. Um, 
for dinner is super yummy. Um, I tasted me and daddy. It tasted like me because it is me, and it's super good. And if you like, and if you get that recipe, get it right because it's gonna taste good. Bye. Did you bring what? <laughs> My man had good decisions. Oh yeah. <laughs> he likes to do that. <laughs> so what are you doing? So since I um finished reading, I'm just reading for fun. And this is the book of Captain Underpants <laughs> and the Terrific Return of Tippy. Well, this is our to read right here. Mm. Daddy, can you try to read it? Huh? Where? Right here. Uh, Tinkle tr uh, Trousers. Tinkle Trousers. <laughs> That's a flip. And here's a flipporama. A flipporama. Let me go to the page where it explains and shows you. It's this. So it says, this chapter contains sentences, sentences of intense brawly. I don't know how to say that. Mm. Brutality. Brutality. And is in, intended for... Hi, Daddy. Make, make <laughs> sure. this good. Attendance only. Can I see them all? Can I see them all? And Adam is already asleep. Good night. See you tomorrow. Boop. Hey guys, I am home. It is 11.30. Mm -hmm. It was a very, very busy night. Um, which is great because I do have a quota to meet for the season so I always appreciate when it's a busy night and I'm slammed from the time I get there to the time that I leave. Um, I ate dinner kind of late so my stomach is kind of growling at me because it's upset I ate so late and Maddie just got up and took her to the bathroom which was really sad. Andres was saying she was crying. She's the only one that cared I wasn't here. <laughs> she was crying. Um, or a little upset that I wasn't here. I guess at least to tuck her in. So that worked out perfectly. Got her up, took her to the bathroom. Helped her blow her nose. Poor thing. She is always stuffed up. Always. Her allergies kick her butt big time. Kind of like me. I feel like I, lately I've been stuffed up too. But I got home probably around... I don't like what time? Close to 11? It's what it's going to be like. Although tomorrow I'll be home... I'm gonna try and leave sometime between eight and nine. So my goal first thing in the morning is to get the vlog edited, exported, and pre-uploaded, scheduled, so that when I get home, I can just go straight to bed because I work at the hospital Wednesday. So yeah, I'm going to call it a night. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's vlog and we will see you tomorrow.